He's represented this area in Harrisburg since 1996 and is now the leader of his party in the state Senate. But Jay Costa is facing a rare challenge in the upcoming Democratic primary. Political editor John Delano reports it comes from a businessman who says it's time for a change. The Costa name was political gold until two Costas lost their state house seats two years ago, leaving Senator Jay Costa all alone. But now he too has a Democratic challenger. I'm kind of pushing for the future of the Democratic Party, which is a young, aggressive party of young people that could succeed and could take over the state government, which I know has um, held back a lot of progress, particularly from Senator Costa. 38-year-old Bill Britton, owner of Shadyside Nursery, says Costa is part of an old boys network influenced by the wealthy. He's very entrenched in a system and it has worked the way that he has helped make it work for the past 24 years, and I don't think that is the way forward. But Costa makes no apologies for holding the top spot among Democrats in the Senate and says it helps the region. We don't want folks from other parts of the state making decisions with respect to the issues that are important to us. We want to have the ability to have a voice at that table. And I think that's what I bring in my position as Democratic leader. Costa says he listens closely to constituents in the 43rd District from Pittsburgh to Penn Hills. But for a number of areas like health care and and gun safety measures and the environment, uh, education funding and criminal justice reform. Those are just a handful of the areas that I've heard from folks here in my district, in our district, that I brought to Harrisburg. While he points to his record as reason for re-election. I hope I've earned the support, continued support of the voters of our district. His challenger calls for change. We need to fundamentally address who has the power and the economics in our system or we're never gonna change anything. John Delano, KDKA News.